फाइव सेकेंड्स टू गो स्टार्ट दी अपीलांट वॉज कन्विक्टेड बाय एडिशनल सेशंस जज कोटा राजस्थान फॉर ऑफेंस पनिशेबल अंडर सेक्शन 302 ऑफ द आईपीसी ही वॉज सेंटेंस्ड टू लाइफ इम्प्रिजनमेंट इन शॉर्ट द केस ऑफ द प्रोसिक्यूशन इज दैट ऑन ट्वेंटी फोर्थ फेब्रवरी नाइनटीन नाइन्टी सेवन दपीलांट कट द थ्रोट्स ऑफ हिज चिल्ड्रन राकेश एंड राजकांता विद अ ब्लेड इन द हाउस ऑफ हिज इन लॉज वेयर ही वॉज स्टेइंग फॉर हिज ट्रीटमेंट ही वॉज सफरिंग फ्रॉम ट्यूबर क्लोसिस अकॉर्डिंग टू द प्रोसिक्यूशन दिस इंसिडेंट वॉज विटनेस्ड बाय बनवारी द ब्रदर इन लो ऑफ द अपीला बनवारी इन्फॉर्म्ड अबाउट इट टू हिज ब्रदर काजोड हु हैड कम फ्रॉम द मार्केट काजोड फाउंड राकेश डेड राजकांता वॉज अलाइव एंड वॉज इन पेन काजोड टुक हर टू द डॉक्टर एंड द डॉक्टर डिक्लेयर्ड हर डेड काजोड लोज एफ आई आर इन्वेस्टिगेशन वॉज स्टार्टिड the appellant was arrested after completion of the investigation the appellant came to be charged under section 302 of the ipc in support of its case prosecution examined 14 witnesses pw2 banwari is the i witness he is a child witness his evidence is material to the prosecution the appellant pleaded not guilty to the charge he stated that he was falsely implicated in the case because his relations with his wife's family were strained shri santosh mishra learned counsel appearing for the appellant submitted that the entire case rests on the testimony of a child witness the child witnesses evidence has to be carefully scrutinized and only if it is found reliable it can be accepted he submitted that pw2 banwari's evidence does not answer the test laid down by this court in numerous judgments and hence no reliance can be placed on him in support of this submission counsel relied on rameshwar son of kalyan singh versus state of rajasthan air 39 1952 sc 54 panchi and others versus state of up 1998 7 scc 177 ratan singh dal sukhbai nayak वर्सेस स्टेट ऑफ गुजरात टू थाउजेंड फोर वन एस सी सी सिक्सटी फोर एंड राजकुमार वर्सेस स्टेट ऑफ महाराष्ट्र टू थाउजेंड नाइन फिफ्टीन एस सी सी टू हंड्रेड नाइन्टी टू ही सबमिटेड दैट द एंटायर इंसिडेंट अपीयर्स टू बी इनहेरेंटली इम्प्रोबेबल इफ थ्रोट्स ऑफ टू चिल्ड्रन वर कट विद अ ब्लेड they would have raised loud cries and that would have brought the neighbors to the room counsel submitted that there are inconsistencies in the evidence of the witnesses the story that pw2 banwari saw the incident through the hole of the door is difficult to digest counsel submitted that recovery of blade from the possession of the pilant is also not proved motive is also not established in the circumstances benefit of doubt must be given to the pilant who is in jail for about 19 years shri milind kumar learned counsel for the state on the other hand submitted 
that child witness pw2 banwari inspires confidence it is established that the appellant was alone in the room with his children and hence none else but he can be held responsible for their murder counsel pointed out that pertinently on the clothes of the appellant blood was found the blood group of those stains matched with that of the blood found on the clothes of deceased rajkanta this indicates that the appellant killed his children counsel submitted that therefore the conviction and sentence of the appellant be confirmed the post mortem notes make it clear that the throats of the children were cut we have gone through the evidence rather minutely because we felt that the approach of the trial court and the high court was not right we shall therefore briefly refer to the evidence there is no challenge to the prosecution case that at the material time the appellant was staying in his in laws house with his children pw1 ka jod stated that on the date of incident at about 2 pm the appellant sent him to bring kachori and jalebi within half an hour he came back since deceased rakesh had high fever the appellant told him to bring a tablet from the shop when he came back with a tablet he saw a crowd gathered in front of his house store